Utah and Texas want to build more small modular nuclear reactors, and they're suing the federal government in an attempt to make it easier to do so. Joining the states is nuclear developer Last Energy, which says current laws have prevented it from building these facilities in the U.S. The suit targets the U.S. Nuclear Regulatory Commission, claiming its regulations hindered the development of small modular reactors and micro-reactors. According to the filing, these smaller reactors are cheaper, use less nuclear fuel, and pose no threat to public health or safety. The plaintiffs argue that such reactors should not be required to obtain NRC licenses for construction or operation. These licenses, they say, can be incredibly costly to obtain and maintain, making these projects economically unfeasible for developers. Last Energy previously spent $2 million attempting to build small nuclear reactors in Texas, but abandoned the project due to what it described as prohibitive federal regulations. The lawsuit comes after Utah Governor Spencer Cox announced Operation Gigawatt, a more than $20 million plan to support carbon-free nuclear power infrastructure in the state. Meanwhile, the Public Utility Commission of Texas recently recommended the state deploy more nuclear power to enhance energy security and grid reliability. However, critics of the suit, such as the group Utah Citizens Advocating Renewable Energy, argue that relaxing federal regulations could compromise safety. The organization also contends that the claims about how safe these reactors are can be misleading. A spokesperson for the NRC stated that the agency will address the lawsuit in court filings. For Straight Arrow News, I'm Kara Rucker, and for more stories like this, you can download the SAN mobile app today.